Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I am here to plan, to film and plan another week in my Tipsy Dog Designs TPC Nation Planner. We just got done filming uh, my monthly for September. So, ta-da, we've got that going on. Um, we are coming to the end of this planner because it started in November. That is when we released it. I am so excited because she is a chunky monkey. Um, so I am starting the first week. Like, so we're gonna have the end of August and then September because September starts football and we have a football game, Georgia does on Saturday. So I, um, and I'm just ready for football. I am freaking ready for football. All right. So this is last week. Oh, I figured out where to use the speech bubble. Ta-da. And actually, guess what? This is today. This is today. I'm so excited. Um, I am on time. I am back to filming Monday on Sundays. I got my little iced coffee right here. It's delicious. Um, we are gonna be using the football kit from my shop. I did a very generic football kit because it's just way too hard to do the um, different teams, um, the colors and stuff. I mean, I would have, my whole shop would be nothing but football kits. I'm trying to find the days of the week here. Um, so we can, not the days of the week, the numbers, 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 numbers. You are around here somewhere. Cause I was just using you. Okay. That's what, yep. It's going to be this page. Okay. So we got that going on. I am so excited. All right. So in this house, we are... Georgia Bulldog fans. Nope, I'm a Georgia Bulldog fan. Russell Wayne is a Clemson Tiger fan, which they are not rivals. Um, they play every eight years for three seasons. Um, and so we, I do not know when the last, I think we played last year. I can't remember. Last year was such a blur because uh, Georgia was national champions. We beat Alabama, and if there are Alabama fans out there, I am sorry. But I know winning a national championship is normal for you guys. You know it's not normal for us. It's been a very long time since we won a national championship. So I am just going to keep uh, celebrating it until the new national champions are crowned. And I'm going to say, let's go dogs again. So let's make it a twofer. <laughs> oh, okay. So today is the 28th. So tomorrow is the, oops. And I'm picking up a six and a seven with it. Urgh, give it to me. And thank you very much. Um, but yeah, so it makes me very excited. We love college football in this house. We are not uh, pro ball fans. Uh, we just never have been. Um, we will watch pro ball if we are out somewhere and it is on TV. Um, like, for instance, if we're at a friend's house or something or, you know, we're at a bar with friends for that specific reason. I mean, we will watch it. It's just not our jam. Um... But, so we don't have a team that we pull. I was trying to pull that one off and I thought I was going to get stuck. We don't have a team that we root for necessarily. Um, by default, I am a Packers fan, according to my best friend, Selena, because it's the same G, just different colors. So she buys me Packer fans, Packer stuff all the time. Um, so that I can cheer for the Packers. <laughs> but, you know, it is what it is. Okay. So one, two, if I, I definitely need to start, wait, one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so there's four. So color design, color design, color design, color, right? 
yeah. One, two, three, yeah, okay. Last time when I laid my kit down, I ended up having design strips two next to each other, which that video will be posted after I film finish filming this one. I forgot to put it up, fail on my part. Um, but it's all good. Oh, yep. Yeah, I'm using these and I shouldn't be because it makes it harder. Um, yeah, so Russ is Clemson. I am Georgia, which we live in Carolina, Gamecock land. So being a Clemson fan is not unusual because Clemson and Carolina uh, are both here in South Carolina. Um, but me being a University of Georgia fan is unusual and we're also very hated. Um, cause we are Carolina's biggest rivalry. Um, but we are, they are not ours because our biggest rivalry is Florida. Um, our rivalry goes back and far and deep so much that um, we can't even play on each other's home fields. <laughs> we have to play in a neutral location in Jacksonville. So there's that. All right. Uh, but yeah, so it's football season. I am really excited. Uh, a week from today, or a week from Tuesday, the 30th, I leave for Salem. I cannot wait. This is the last TPC meetup of the year, which is sad, but next year is going to be so much fun. Um, and this is wrapping up a very nice year. So we will have, so after, at the end of this month, um, cause I've got Salem and then while we're in Salem, the TPC sale starts. So that's going to be very different and unusual for me in the past, ever since I have started with TPC, uh, which I did the sale a couple times in 2019 when I still worked my corporate job. And then I did it all, but like two months, I think, in 2020. And then in 2021, I did it a handful of times. So ever since I've started with TPC, I've always made sure that I am home when the sale starts that whole weekend. Because since I'm a ready to ship shop, I like to go ahead and start on orders. Because I have this thing called Catholic guilt. And I cannot stand to see the order numbers pile up and know that people are waiting for stickers. Um, I also have no um, patience. And so I like instant gratification. <laughs> so therefore, that's why my shop is ready to ship. Um, but yeah, so this is going to be different and it's probably going to make me a little on edge all weekend. So if you're going to Salem, I do apologize, but I just like, I like to get my orders out as soon as possible. And I fly home on Sunday and I don't land until I think eight 30. So I will, um, not be able to start on them Sunday, but Monday morning, you can guarantee you that when Russ leaves for work at, oh no, that's right. Okay. He's going to, yeah, I'm definitely, the week after Salem is going to be, I'm going to be really mean to myself. So Russ leaves for St. Augustine on Monday with my dad. They'll be back on Friday. They do an annual golf trip down there every year. And so... Um, it's Russ and my dad and a couple of my dad, but dad's buddies, um, our friend Thomas, Thomas and Selena that we always hang out with. Um, uh, Thomas tries to go if he can, but with his job, uh, he hasn't been able to, um, okay, well that didn't work out. Um, so yeah. So that means Russ is not going to be home all next week. So there is not going to be anybody here to remind me, hey, yo, 
you need to take a day off, you need to come downstairs, you need to eat. So, I'm gonna be really mean to myself next month, or ne that week after. Cause I will probably just stay up in my office and work 15 and 16 hours a day getting orders out um, like a crazy person. But at the end of September, the last weekend, which will still be free for all Friday. Yeah. Um, my mom and sister and I, we rented a beach house in Charleston. Um, so we're doing a staycation because uh, my dad will have Alden and my sister's dog. And then they'll be getting ready for St. Augustine. But nope, they will have already been back. Just kidding. So... My mom and my sister and I, we've never done a girl's trip, just the three of us, and my mom keeps talking about it. And as we get older, it's definitely one of those things we want to do. So the off season, like after Labor Day, it's considered the off season down there at the beach. So we were able to get a cute little house for super cheap, less than a hotel room. Um, and it's uh, right across the street from the beach. Um, so we can sit on the porch and see the ocean um and it's and it was just going to be a time for us to get away have fun relax just the three of us without my nephew being around or my dad or russ and the dogs just so we can catch up because my mom and sister and i are very close and we never get any alone time sometimes where we can just hang out catch up not have any responsibilities like feeding the dog, feeding my nephew, feeding my dad, <laughs> that kind of stuff. So I am really, really excited about this. Uh, um, and we're gonna try to make it a yearly thing. Where's the word social? <gasps> Don't tell me that I am out. I will be very upset. Oh, I won't. I am. Okay. I'm going to have to print some more because the word social goes right here. All right. So, uh, um, all right. So how, what are we going to do here? What are we going to do? Um, it's free for all Friday this weekend. So I am working, you know what? Let's do the most important thing. Um, first, I uh, grab these brown splashes because you know they're like a football field. Ah! Just kidding. And they are. All right, I know. Just in case you're wondering, um, I do not sell these in the shop because all of, um, logos are trademarked, so I do not want to get fined, um, or in big trouble or get a nasty cease and desist letter. So I made these for myself. Um, but I do have some football stuff in the shop and I think I am going to offer as a specialty like go and then whatever team with just the football because none of that stuff is trademarked. Um, so yeah, I think I just realized in the monthly that I was filming that that would be a really good idea. So that's what I'm going to do. Um, all right. So, and then we've got, this is Full Box Friday. Let's see here, I feel like I have that word somewhere. Yep, there it is, okay. So, um, yeah. My sister, oh, I just totally covered up that whole word. My sister and Alden are also coming on Friday, so she's gonna be helping me fill orders since I leave on Tuesday for 
um, since I leave on Tuesday for Salem, I have got to get all of these orders out before I leave, which was hindsight. I probably should not have done it, but I like to try and keep the shop on schedule as much as possible. Um, even though I'm going to be in the TPC sale the following week, it's just, I like to keep, try and keep the same schedule. Um, the only thing that's going to change is like I showed in my monthly is we're not going to do new releases, of course, because we're going to have a bunch of new stuff for here. So I might add in another Sassy Saturday. I'm going to see how it goes because I won't even start filling orders until mon the Monday the 12th. So I don't know that I want to put something unnecessary on me again. So I might throw it around the 24th. We shall we shall see. Um, all right. So yeah, we shall see. Um, do, do, do. I feel like there's not a lot more to do. I can do, um, where did, oh, here's the kit. I'm like, where did the whole kit go? All right. So we are going to have Andrea and Alden are coming in. So that'll be fun. All right, so that's happening. And then let's see here. I know. Uh, doo -doo -doo. We'll put this one right here. So excited for football. All right, I'm really not quite sure what else needs to go down because there is a lot that is gonna be happening this week um, in personal and in the shop because I have to get prepared for next week and then I have to finish customs and then have to get ready for the sale so there's a lot going on so I think I'm going to leave it like this for now which I know is really boring and bare but I promise you it'll look all kind of things exciting um, by the next time that you see it I promise uh, but yeah all right so I hope you guys are having a great day. It's Sunday, I'm so excited. I am getting this done. I feel like my week is gonna be so much more productive now that this is all done. Um, I do plan on having all orders out by Monday from this weekend. So, oh, you know what? I can, we can throw a little, cause this is definitely gonna be Tuesday is definitely going to be a design day. I wonder, let's see here. First of all, let me turn this like this because it makes it easier. What if, ah, I pulled a big one too. <laughs> Stick this like this and then we write design day. Just to make more. All right, there we go. How cute is that? All right, I know this is super boring and I'm sorry guys, but I have to really lay all my thoughts down and um, see what I get accomplished today and then uh, move forward. So uh, I hope you guys have a great Sunday. And as usual, if you like this thumbs up, um, let me know what you think about just doing go and then having the t name of the team with the football. I feel like that's a cool idea that kind of will give everybody their personalized team ones without, uh, infringing on any copyright, um, items. So, all right, you guys have a great one and I will talk to you later.